G'day all and welcome back. Huey here for yet another episode of Civilization VI Rise and Fall in our long-haul marathon series playing as Russia. And in the last episode we nabbed uh, Sydney Opera House. Um, so that will um, be very, very useful, particularly for great works of, uh, for our great musicians. And we're six turns away from getting the um, Estadio de Maracana. I'm actually saying that uh, with ease now. <laughs> I remember struggling with that one for a while. Um, that's assuming I'm getting it right to begin with. So, And we're 34 turns away from um, a Munson and Scott research station. Um, so, we're two turns from our first hangar. We're about to get a research lab, another one. Um, so that will help with our science per turn. And we're eight turns away from our nuclear submarine armada. So that's a long time coming. Um, now we want to keep an eye on Nubia because uh, in terms of tech they've overtaken Scythia and they're making 477 science per turn. We are making 609 so it's not too much of a concern but it's one worth uh, as I said keeping an eye on. So let's hit the next turn. How's our new city over here going? It's growing nicely. Oh, okay, we've got our archaeologist, so let's um, excavate our shipwreck. Okay, the world's first ex expedition in marine archaeology produces the necklace and shows the sea cannot hide the secrets of history any longer. So we've got plus four error score for that, so that's fantastic. Now, um, we also had to flip this city. And you are, a, yeah, you're a proselytizer. So I'll spread you. And we're doing quite nicely taking over the Cree territory in terms of religion. So we get to choose our artifact. Um, or free cities. Um, I think we'll go for. A Manator. So, which um, era is this? From the industrial era. Okay. All right. Well, it still helps with the, our tourism, so that's great. And we should be able to. Once we get our uh, hangar done, we can fit two more aircraft in our aerodrome here. We're also very busy fixing our uh, workshop. Now also in the last episode we upgraded our tank armies to modern armor. So they're quite powerful at the moment. Which kind of needed to do because of all those um, yeah, partisan uh, there's partisans turning up now they're in the form of modern armor so yeah they're a little bit tougher than before and we we'll probably also um, I will need to buy a unit at some point um, won't be able to afford that for a little while though it's unfortunate Yeah, but, um, ideally I'd like to get a core, but, oh well. Alright, let's send you up. So you're our debater. You're our proselytizer. Let's quickly choose production. So our research lab is done. Which has, um, spiked up our science pattern even more. And let's see what we can do in terms of tourism. Um... So housing like 19 of 26, we should be okay. Uh, let's see. Water park could be a good investment. But you know, I think we'll go for uh, an observatory.
Yes, I think so. Let's get an observatory. Yes, yes, Moscow doesn't have enough food. I'm waiting for the next uh, governor <coughs> promotion. Alright, so there's Chili Nipples in uh, yet another Cree city. So let's have a look around here. Where's our next shipwreck? Right there. Okay, so we'll be able to get a uh, Mapachi. Um, yeah, artifact by the looks of it. Since this is a former Mapachi um, city. Although we could get a Nor Norwegian one as well. <coughs> That's quite possible. <coughs> so once we um, excavate all uh, three artifacts. We'll do a little bit more trading for other artifacts. Mm, that would be a nice one, but <clears throat> I think we need to focus on our tourism for now. Um, I haven't completely given up on trying for a religious victory, obviously. <coughs> But as I, you know, have stated multiple times, it's looking less and less likely. So, should be our turn coming up. I wonder if we can try for an alliance with Alexander yet. Let's have a look. Hi. Can we do an alliance with you yet? Nope. Alright, don't worry about it. Um, I wonder if the Kree want to be friends. <laughs> You're at war with Scythia. You want to be friends? Oh! We're friends! <laughs> that is such a surprise. Uh, we can't get an alliance with him though. So, but that, that will make things a lot easier for us. So... Kazan needs more amenities. Alright, well... Uh, now that we're friends with our... With, um, with the Kree... Hello, new friend. You got, uh... Nothing I really want. Maybe furs? What would it take? Uh, <laughs> Hang on, aren't we friends? Uh, never mind. <clears throat> I'll just have to live with it. Although we do have a very high alliance level. A couple of other sieves. So let's try Yad Vega first. She has silk. What, what would you want for that? Okay, that's much more reasonable. Um, do you want some spices? And give me some money? Holy crap. She must be amenity starved. What was it, 3,000? One. 3,100. I'll take it. Okay. She's very happy. You're welcome. Alright, goodbye. Okay, so. Enough for a what? We've got some more. Uh, some more luxuries. <clears throat> so now we've finished the hangar. I think we rush out the airport. Uh, plus two air unit slots. And we can rapidly deploy. Yeah, I think we get the airport. And I am going to need to work on a second aerodrome at some point. Um, Papue. Papiwe, nah, I won't flip you. I will flip Antioch though. Actually, which one has a holy site? Neither. Alright, so let's go grab Antioch then.
<clears throat> Excuse me. Now, um, we're already getting a tech boost in. Wait a second. Did we already gain so uh, gain sources? <clears throat> no, we didn't. Excuse me. Okay. Yeah, this weather's getting really, really terrible. Um, where I live, it's uh, northern Australia, so which would kind of be um, interesting because um, we're coming into storm season. So <laughs> that'll be interesting when ca gathering storm comes out. You know, because I'll be actually most likely. Uh, in the midst of that stuff. Uh, but anyway, we can talk more about climate change once that comes out. So we have four turns from uh, the Stadia de Maracana. Let's get ourselves another artifact. This is another plus one error score. Let's choose the artifact. So let's get Harold. From the industrial era. Nice. Flintlock pistol. Interesting. Okay, next turn. And how's our culture looking? It's gone up even more. Nice. Oh wow. It's just skyrocketed since the last time I looked at it. So what's that? It's still a, it's only a little bit over halfway because our required tourists have gone up. Although <clears throat> it's good for us because we've got the um, the de the require the tourism de dedication for our golden age. Um, it's not as high as everyone else's. I do believe that's the case. Alright, so what I'm going to do here um, with nuclear fusion is I'm going to um, change that up. And see if we can possibly get a, uh, a boost through a spy. Or a great scientist for that matter. Um, I did see one over here somewhere. Where were you? Uh, Alright, we better change our... What is it? Um, nope, that's not the one. Ah, here we go. Yield. Yield icons, no. Show resource icons. Oh, it's already up there. What am I talking about? So I'm trying to find it. Um, I swear it was around here somewhere. Ah, oh, there. There we go. You'll do, anyway. I was positive we had three, though. Within our borders, that is. Huh. Maybe not. Maybe it's down here? No. Nope, nope, nope. <clears throat> nope, and nope. Well, I guess you'll have to do. It will have to do. Alright. So, uh, we now need to repair. I think we'll repair the art museum first. Okay, let's send you in. Send you in. This should flip it, yes. So I'm putting even yet more pressure on them. A Zulu submarine there, okay. Now, <clears throat> I'd love to take over a couple of Nubian cities, particularly. Uh, these two. Maybe even these. 
And we're just going to have to wait for the perfect excuse for that, though. So I do have some spies there I don't want to... Oh, hello. She's got a stadium. So we might not be guaranteed this wonder. <laughs> Partisan forces, there they are. And they're going to go after my trader. Of course they are. And probably my industrial zone again. Ah, oh dear. <clears throat> now the spy evaded capture. Which is a damn shame. But fortunately, we're not focusing on wonder building. Yeah, there's our trader pillaged. Uh, I'm going to have to run you away. Maybe. Unfortunately, we do have a modern armor army. I'm going to move you to St. Petersburg so we can get that. Um, keep that production up as much as we can. Uh, just go this way. Alright, so first we can bombard you. We can only use one of our jet fighters, so... I'm going to hit you. Can you actually reach? No, you can't. That's fine. This should finish him off. Alright, and well let's purchase another trader. Costing us quite a bit. Um, and then we'll use our two bombers. It's not going to do much damage, unfortunately. So that was the Cree. Okay. So we discovered who it was. <clears throat> Hang on from an unknown sieve, but it says... Huh. How did I find out about it then? Interesting. I think I'm going to move you. Then, <clears throat> I'll send you in for an attack. That's a major victory. I'll hide you in here. Um, <clears throat> now, I don't really have anything else that I can finish him off with, unfortunately. But that's okay. <clears throat> um, let's keep repairing the art museum. So now we have five envoys. Uh, let's see. Anyone in particular we want? Um, I don't know. I mean, we could knock off. <clears throat> we could knock Alexander off um, Buenos Aires. <coughs> any of the Nubia... Nubia doesn't appear to have any. Oh yes, Kabul. So let's actually knock off Kabul. Now what do we get for... Double experience. Okay. What do you want? Trying to jet bomber. Well, that's 
very likely. So let's um, save two of our envoys and turn the placement there. So we've grabbed Kabul. Let's go have a talk with the Kree since we just declared friendship. Uh, let's discuss. Hi. Thank you. So we've got the um, we've got yet another promise. I'm being really nice here. Normally I'd I'd give them one chance and then just declare war on them. <laughs> so now we've got a trading post in Glimapu. It's uh, we should get more out of it. it. Should be very helpful. Now, Kabul um, has got quite a lot of units. And they did take out Hong Kong, I do remember that, and it was, I was kind of peeved about it too. Get an Eastern Orthodoxy Apostle here. Um, you want oil? Uh, no. I'm not going to give you oil. Um. I wouldn't mind your ivory. Ah, no. Nah. I'm gonna refuse that. Sorry. Yeah, so... This guy's gonna be a bit of a pain. Excuse me. Do we need to buy more traders? Possibly. I think we are building one somewhere, aren't we? <clears throat> well, that's okay. Just bombard him and then we'll insta kill him. That should do. Well, first things first. Let's get rid of you. Ah, oh, here we go. It's in that lock-up thing that it does with the uh, <clears throat> the trader units sometimes. So you go on alert. You know what? Let's make the trader out. Come on, thank you. No, I don't want to transfer, I want to make a trade route. Okay. <clears throat> so, who's the best one? None of these. Well, that's the Cree. Um, I guess we could go to Plock. It doesn't give us a lot of gold. Hmm. Gila might be risky. Yervin wants a trade route. I probably should do it. Just to get another envoy. So, okay, yep. Yeah. <clears throat> Go to Yervin. Let's move you to St. Petersburg. Uh, yep, that way. That way. Alert. And I think we'll send you to. We can't really send you to Lotaro's territory, so we'll send you to Plock. <coughs> Hickory Dickory Plock. And you can go back in to home, let's fortify. Uh, you've got one charge left, and I think I'm just going to put you to sleep for now. Because I can't see any more silos. Um, yeah, 
that are going to be immediately useful. Maybe Kazan, but uh, I don't think so. Alright, you can sleep and let's hit the next turn. Hopefully we won't get this stolen from us. Oh, it looks like our archaeologist is ready to do his thing. And yet another one from the industrial era. Now, let's get one from Gorgo. Broadsheet. So th I think that gives us another um, themed museum, because they're all industrial era by the looks of it. So let's look at the Great Works, and... was it Oslo? Archaeological Museum... Yep, themed. Nice. Nice. Very nice, okay. So that's just pumped up our... Um, tourism even further. And a culture paturn, for that matter. So a culture paturn is, is really making a, um, a huge surge forward. Now normally your science paturn is way ahead of your culture paturn, but in our case it looks to be catching up. And... Oh, you had Vegas having a turn. Poland is now allied with Brazil. Interesting. Spartiate escalose iesan. Carteros, iscuros, Andreos. Well, thanks, Gorgo, but, um, um, yeah, I might be at war with Brazil, but I'm not really d actively doing anything. <laughs> oh, Gorgo finally got suffrage, which means she'll. Probably go for democracy, I would say, if she's smart. So, like I said, this is the AI we're talking about, so. Down through its history, only three people have managed to silence the Maracana the Pope, Frank Sinatra, and me. It's very modest. So, plus two amenities in each city in your civilization. So, uh, and that'll give us bonus tourism as well. So, there's our amenity problems uh, solved for now. Okay. Uh, let's actually go back to Poland. Send you over here. Da -da -da. You that way as well. So it's plus five error score. And, and so now we've done that, we can. Um, oh, I think a hotel's very wise. Indeed. Oh, you can't really move one. Uh, we'll just keep you there then. Alright. <clears throat> so. How are we looking down here? 32 turns. Alright. Looks good to me. We'll be able to get a couple more aircraft pretty soon. <clears throat> and honestly, I think... Uh, I don't know, I might get one of each. Get a jet fighter and a bomber. Put him over here somewhere. Like here, maybe. I don't know. Um, but we definitely need that. Um. Also, actually, getting some helicopters might not be a bad idea. 
Now, I want to keep an eye on our open borders as well. Buenos Aires is in big trouble. Glad I didn't um, go for grabbing them. And our friendship with Alexander's run its course. So we'll have to get that back up. Uh, hi, Alexander. Do you want to be friends? Yes. Can we get an alliance? We can get an economic. Um, you know what? Never mind. Because I, I think I want to keep that with Lotaro. Yeah, let's declare friendship. Let's get an alliance uh, economic. Or should we get cultural? You know what, let's get cultural. 300? Okay. Yeah. And so then we can get our um, economic alliance with. Wait, let's check with the Advega. And she can only do a research alliance. Oh, that's fine. Five hundred. Not bad. You must be desperate for science. You're welcome. Okay, so let's get our economic alliance with uh, Alexander. Two hundred done. Okay. <clears throat> now the borders have closed with the Cree. So we need to make a deal. Uh what? Wait a second. Oh, we've already got open borders, alright. Never mind then. Um, so we've got that back with Alexander. Let's talk to Harold. Oh, never mind. Wait a minute. You've denounced us. Okay. Yeah, you've denounced us. Damn it. Okay. Let's get open borders with you. Sure, <clears throat> and we've got open borders with you, and that's all the deals we can do for now. Alright, and we've gained um, dominance over the Zulu, so that's another one that bites the dust. And we can send you in. So I guess we're sending you up here. And I'll send you in as backup. And I might put you up there. Okay. And I think we'll leave it there, folks. So thanks so much again for joining me. Hope you can join me next time. But until then, take it easy and bye for now.